Hey, what's going on, guys? And welcome back to another. But today we'll be reacting to my travel map. Okay. This is a YouTuber. I watch it, and this is gonna let me explain it to you. Like this, we'll probably watch that after this. Is that Oh, I don't think Dad appreciated the musical 
lumber. When we got to the hospital, the doctors ended up having to push my teeth back into their original position, but these teeth were pretty much destroyed. Oh, and when mom showed up to the hospital, she said dad was covered in blood and looked like that he'd lost a fight with an angry cat. Not dad. There wasn't anything more that the doctors could do at the hospital, but we still had to wait two weeks for me to heal before I could see a dentist. And what the dentist ended up having to do was give my front two teeth a root canal and then fill up the compound so it would stay in my head until my front teeth were ready to come in. You know, I'm actually really glad that I don't remember any of this. I'm already insane and remembering it up as this. Who knows how bad I'd be today if I had to carry around this child in front of me. The whole ordeal had basically killed my front two teeth, and they turned Also, the next two over need to have a crown on the back of it, and given that teeth are translucent, that made the tooth look green. So yeah, for the next few years of my childhood, I was walking around with yellow and green teeth. Just look at this jacked up mouth of mine. I think I had these teeth until I was about six or seven. And as you can imagine, such a blow to the face not only messed up my baby teeth, but my permanent teeth came in wonky as well. In fact, when I went to the orthodontist to get braces and nails, she discovered I had four permanent teeth that were supposed to come in, but were stuck up in my gums. And I get teeth removed so they could come in. My mouth was a train wreck. Thankfully, I think I finally got these chompers under control. My dad did eventually get that play fort built. I thought he'd think twice about letting his clumsy daughter up in high places, but eh, none of the parent children ever fell on that fort. I guess I set a pretty good example of what not to do. You hear that, Mom? Your daughter's a trailblazer. Hey, explainers, just want to say thanks to Eddie Bully for letting his voice in the Tooth Fairy. And I'll leave a link to his channel in the description. I genuinely do love his stuff, so go check him out. I also want to say a big thank you to my longtime friend, Megan Mayer, for supporting a second. Okay. I'm really excited about this. She's going to be periodically jumping in on videos and helping me. We've been talking about it since February, and it's finally come to fruition. And hopefully this means... Well, um, anyways, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. And make sure y'all leave a like, subscribe, and see y'all next time.